Hey, how you doing, beautiful? Good. What's your name? Bianca. Bianca, I don't mean to come up to you like that. I'm just, I thought you was real pretty. I like to get your number or something. You seem like a vibe. I'm a vibe, you know what I mean? I'm sorry, I can't. Why not? Because I have a boyfriend. You got a boyfriend? Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Where he at? Why he got you walking? I'm only walking up the street. We're about to, I just parked right here so I can go to the bar. Oh, you going to the bar? This early? Yeah. You taking shots? 12 o'clock somewhere. Well, look, I'd love to come take some shots with you. You know what I mean? Uh, I don't know. What you mean? I think my girls only got one seat. I mean, me. well, look, I don't got to I don't gotta sit down. I stand up. You know what I mean? Let me get your number or something. How about you just get my Instagram? Your Instagram? Yeah. Why don't I get your Instagram? Because I don't just give out my number like that. Why? Well, right, let me go to my car and get my other phone number. Hold on. You said what? I mean, yeah. Thank you. Come here real quick. Got one, coach. Come over here. What you said your name was again? Bianca. Bianca? London, yeah. London, London. So let me get your Instagram. I know you in a rush and everything. I'll just give you my number. I thought you said you, you ain't want to give me a number. You had a boyfriend. You seem like you're a cool guy. I got a nice car. You look good. I like your shoes, by the way. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Where you coming from? The gym or something? Um, no. I just left home. Okay, okay. You look nice. Do a little 360 for me. Let me see. A little 360? Yeah, do a little 360. See the whole outfit. You know what I mean? Yeah, this is my friend's okay, uh, okay. friend. Okay, okay. It's all there, too. I see. Yeah. Oh, yeah, let me uh, let's take your number, though. Cool. What you got going on for the rest of the day? Like I said, I'm about to go meet my friends. About to have something to drink. Okay, okay, for sure, for sure. Well, I understand you got a boyfriend. Maybe we can be friends. I see you another day or something. Where you about to go? I was actually about to go to the Galleria. Oh, and do it. I uh, just get, cut, get a couple things. You know what I mean? Shop. Oh, okay. What you shopping for? Maybe I can help you. Honestly, I'm about to go out of town. I'm about to go back to Nigeria. I'm from there, so oh, I got to get a couple. Okay. You know, it'd be real hot out there, so. I got a lot of hoodies from the, from the spring, from the, you know, from the winter and shit. Okay. Well, if you need help, just let me know. I mean, what you about to do right now? Like I said, I was going to get some drinks with my friends, but I don't mind going to the Galleria. You want to just hop in there? Cool. Sure, so hop in. Got one, Coach. Coach, What's up with you though? Nothing. I want the left there. You said what? Mind if I take a picture here? Oh no, do your thing. Okay. Do your thing. You gotta get me in there though. You gotta let them know you oh, here okay, with me, okay. right? You know what I mean? We look good together, huh? Kinda. Kinda? For sure, for sure. But I thought you had a man though. Uh, it's complicated. What you mean by that? Me and my nigga be on and off and stuff. We've been dating for like eight years, but it's, it's not right now. We're like kind of complicated. Okay, okay. So you're not really together like that. For real, for real. Not for real, for real. Okay, we're separated okay. or something like that. Oh, yeah, separated. Yo, married? No, 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 not like that. Like, we're not together. We're separated. Oh, okay. Yeah. So he do him and you do you. Basically. So why you just acting like that out there? You told me you had a man. Like, he wasn't interested. Because, you know, a lot of people be trying to talk to you just because of how you look and stuff. And yeah, but I, I ain't one of them. I'm okay. him, not him. Oh, You feel okay. me? Him, him, for real. Ooh. Like, I think you need to know that, though. You heard? Okay. Like, for real, for real. I'm not, I'm not one of them. Okay. You know what I mean? Period. And, and you look like you her, so... We could be him and her, you know what I mean? Ah, I like that. I for like sure, that. For sure, for sure, for sure. That's my fiance calling me. Oh, so you? I mean, yeah. oh, so you got a situation? I mean, I got a wife over there in Nigeria, or a fiance, she want to be wife, but you know, I don't mean nothing, right? Oh. She ain't over here. Okay. So how long y'all been engaged? Shit, for about a year now. Oh, nice. You know what I mean? I'm actually looking to have some kids and stuff, but I'm trying to. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I'm trying, I'm in the middle of moving back. I don't know if I'm going to move back yet. You know what I mean? I mean, what's wrong with Houston? It's nice, beautiful. I know. Beautiful women, too. Right. Obviously, I ran into you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Would you, you like to travel? What you like to do? I like to travel. Um, I've been to a couple uh, countries. I've been to Greece. I've been to Dubai. 
You better do bye. Okay, okay. Yeah. Heard you, heard you, heard you. Yeah. Who you be going with? I be going with my girlfriends. We just all sally up and we just go. Shit, I always wanted to go to Dubai for real. You should go. It's def definitely a I should go or we should go? We should go. That's why you ain't say that then. You acting like, you know what I mean? Well, I don't know what your schedule be like. You said you got a fiance, so I don't know how. Well, look, that when you with me, don't none of that matter. Oh, okay. you know what I mean, just like when I'm with you, your nigga don't matter, right? Right. I heard that. You, got it, you, got it, you know what I'm saying? Your business is your business. Mine is mine. Got it. You feel me? So Which, you going back to Nigeria? For sure. For a couple for a couple weeks. You know okay. Man? But I got, I got some time for you while I'm here. Nice. So I heard you from Nigeria. Nigeria man got money. I mean, we, we do a little something, something, you know what I mean? So what can you do for me? I mean, I want to match your fly. I want to look as good as you. I mean, what you mean what I could do for you? I mean, I could... Take you know? me shopping. I want to go to Nigeria too. For sure, for sure. We can definitely can go to Nigeria, but I'd rather, you know, take you on a date, get to know you first before we just start blowing the bag, you know what I mean? We should hop on a jet and do that then. Hop on a jet? Yeah. Oh, so you just thinking I got jet money? Do you? I mean, you, that's, that's for you to see. Why, why are you looking like that? Like, do you? Like, if I don't, it's an issue or something. No. no you don't no. fly commercial? Um, first class more so. That's commercial. I'm saying, you saying it like you only fly jets. Oh, no, no. I'm just saying, you say you got money, so I was just... I never said that, though. I never said I had money. I mean, of course I got money. I'm in a $100,000 car. But I'm saying, it's like it's more so like you assuming. Oh, no, no, no. I'm just saying. Okay, you know, it's 2022. We on big and better things, so... What you mean by that? Meaning we have to, you know, live luxurious. Okay, okay. Well, what you what you do for a living? I actually own a spa. A spa? Yeah. So do you work, do you do stuff or do you got employees that do stuff? Like the kids you go with your hands too? Um, not really. I more so just have employees and let them work. So you're not good with your hands? No. So you couldn't give me a massage if I needed one? No. But my employees can. But if you're going to be my, my shorty eventually, you know what I'm saying? Possibly I want you to give me a massage. You know what I'm I want you to be good with your hands. I'm good with men. I'm good with mine. I mean, we can go book that. We can book massages. Oh, we can book it? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So we can't do that at the crib? Like... We can hire somebody to, to come to the house. Okay, okay, okay. And house massages are always the best. So, do let me ask you a question. This is just, I ask women this when I meet them. You believe in 50 50? No. What you mean? I feel like a man should, I think it's more so like 80 10. 80 10? Yeah. What you mean by that? Like, the guy does 80%, the woman only does 10. And what's 10? 10% 10 of me looking good. 10% of you looking good. Yeah. So, you believe that the guy's supposed to pay for everything? Yeah. I mean, but what do you bring to the table? Me. I am the table. What do you... Oh, my God. I really hate when females say that. I'm going to be honest. Like, no, no offense to you. But it's just because it's just like, what do you mean you are the table, though? Like, what you mean by that? Meaning, I come looking good for you, making you look good. But how are you adding value to me if you can't even help out? By looking good. Looking good is nothing. Looks mean nothing. It's a bunch of good looking females out and here. And I know what to do with the money once it's handed to me. And what you gonna do, go shopping with it? Yeah. But what about shit? What about us building an empire together? You get what I'm saying? Like. That's all good and gravy. We just pay somebody to do that. Built the houses. But you, but, you, but you, hold on, hold on. But you just said there's no we, basically. You said it's me. You said you don't believe in 50 50. So you mean me? I pay somebody to do that. I hire the assistant. Yeah, but it's my brains that's getting the people, talking to the people. No, but I can, for do, you. But I can do that though. You, you don't have to when you have the 10%, which is me. I'm just saying though, like, I want to feel special too. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to be doing everything. And that's cool. And I'm going to hire somebody to come to the house and wine and dine, have someone give me a massage, cook the food, catering. Can you cook? I can make some eggs. Eggs? Breakfast Damn. food, bacon. I don't know. You got kids? No. No kids? You want kids? <sighs> kids are not really my thing. No? Mm -mm. I mean, no wrong with that. That's your personal preference. Personal right. preference. So when was your last relationship? Oh, yeah. You said you got a man. Yeah. Mm, so he pay for everything? Basically. And you don't pay for nothing? When I have to. Like gas or something. But like, there's no way you're paying the bill. Mm-mm. But what's wrong with that though? Like, So let me ask you a question. So if I was your man, right? Mm-hmm. And you met me when I was up. 
millions of dollars, and then I just take a loss, and I lose it all. Then what? I don't know. What you mean you don't know? I don't know. You're not gonna be there for me? Yeah, I'll be there for you. But why you, what you mean you don't know then? Why are you saying you don't know? I mean, I'll be there for you as much as I can, but if the money is not there, then I should leave too. Wow, you serious? Yeah. But you're supposed to stick to your, you're supposed to stick with your man through thick and thin though. I gotta thin my way out. That's fucked up though. It's okay though, but that will never happen as long as I'm on your side. I will I'm, make sure you won't go broke. I mean, you said while you're by my side, well, I think you should get the fuck out because you a fucking gold digger. Oh, you shit! You ain't oh, my shit. side ever in your fucking life. You was a fucking gold digger. You just told me that if your man lost it all, that you would leave. You told me that you don't believe in 50-50. 80-10. And that, 80, the, 10. And that the man should that. do everything. No, but what confirmed that you was a gold digger was when you said that you would leave your man if it, if it was no more money. You a fucking gold digger. You need to go home and think about what the fuck you did today. You can go ahead and get the fuck out of my car. How about that? And I sure will. Yeah, go ahead. The fuck out. Matter of fact, before you leave, if you look straight, it's a small camera. You on YouTube. <gasps> yeah. <gasps> you on YouTube. So, you can go ahead and get the fuck out and your nigga might see this. So, yeah. Good luck. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck out of fucking gold. Yo, this shit is crazy. Yo, she is a stone cold gold digger. She just told me that if her nigga loses it all, that she's going to leave him. That's fucking crazy. This the world we live in today is crazy. Yo, don't fall for these women at all. 2022 is fucking crazy. We on the road to a milli. Throw them L's up, London gang. Gang, and that merch on the way. Hope you're ready. Got one, coach.